There is a mature spiritual word that I want to talk about today. The word is understanding. When you take the time to understand others, you're giving them a mighty big gift, a gift that they can take with them, that lifts them up spiritually and in their soul. Don't bypass the potential for meaningful friendships just because of differences. Explore them, embrace them, and even love them. It says in 1 John 4, verse 11, Dear friends, if God loved us in this way, we also must love one another. The reason that we often don't in human mind is one word, differences. And if we take the time to really walk in that other person's shoes, to think in that other person's way, to spend just a little time on the other side of the fence, we'll have something in spiritual maturity that is called understanding. What a blessing it is when our friends and our loved ones genuinely seek to understand who we are and what we think. And so we should understand the hopes and the dreams of family and also friends. We live in such a busy world, a place where it's easy to overlook the needs of others because we have our own needs and we want to make sure that our own needs are met. But there is a higher pinnacle of life and that's to make sure that the needs of all of us are met, not just a few. But God knows every need and understands every heart. God loves each person and God has called upon us, if we are to follow God, to do the same. So today, honor God by showing love to all of God's children. Slow down long enough to notice the trials and the tribulations of those around you and give the gift of understanding, not just to friends and family, but to those who are different from you, even to someone you have just met. It may take a little extra effort and a little extra strength and resolve to do this. It is sometimes easier to pull back and to shield ourselves, but uh, it's not good for the long run. It's not good for the soul of humanity. To those that are different from you, give them a gift of understanding. Take a little extra time and really and sincerely care. It will take a little extra effort, but you'll never know unless you do the treasures of friendship that may just be waiting for you to be discovered. I pray that you do discover those treasures and that it makes you rich indeed in your soul. God bless you.